Hello friends. Today we will discuss the frequently asked interview questions on Cyprus. So let's start. What is Cyprus testing tool? Cyprus is a JavaScript based front end testing tool built for the modern web. It has been written in Node.js. The tool is helpful in executing tests in a browser. This way, it can help make the entire testing process more reliable and much easier. How will you install Cyprus? To install Cyprus, we will first have to install Node. Once done, we can then install Cyprus with the command npm install Cyprus. How will you define Cyprus architecture? Behind this tool is a Node server process. The Node process and Cyprus consistently synchronize, communicate and execute tasks on behalf of each other. Not just that, Cyprus also operates at a network layer by altering and reading web traffic simultaneously. This helps Cyprus in modifying everything coming from the browser. In addition to this, the tool also becomes capable of changing code that could interfere with its capability to automate the entire browser. What are the primary features of Cyprus? Some of the major features of Cyprus include, this tool can run tests and execute commands on the browser. Thus, the tests are much fast and less flaky. It can take snapshots of tests after the execution of every step. This way, you won't need any additional plugins. Cypress also offers network traffic control, inbuilt assertions and automatic wait. What are the advantages of Cypress? Cypress works with internal Ajax calls and single page applications. It is capable of executing commands easily and faster in comparison to tools based on Selenium. This tool can easily take screenshots of tests, thus, we don't need to have any configuration with it. It can run tests and execute commands on the browser. What are the disadvantages of Cyprus? One cannot use Cyprus to drive two browser at the same time. Cyprus only supports JavaScript, TypeScript for creating test cases. Cyprus doesn't provide support for browser like Safari and IE at the moment. Limited support for iframes. It is only available for web testing. How can you differentiate Cyprus from Selenium? Cyprus supports just TypeScript and JavaScript languages. On the other hand, Selenium supports all the major languages such as C-Sharp, Python, Java, Ruby, JavaScript, and more. While Selenium supports all major browser, Cyprus supports just a few of them. In Selenium, the configuration is difficult. In Cyprus, you can find ready-to-use frameworks. What are the testing frameworks that come with Cyprus? Cyprus is available with Chai and Mocha assertion libraries. However, we cannot use the test ng or junit in Cyprus. How can you interact with DOM elements in Cyprus? We can use CSS selector to interact with DOM elements in Cyprus. Can you use BDD with Cyprus? Cyprus doesn't provide any official inbuilt support for BDD. However, the NPM Cypress Cucumber preprocessor plugin lets you write tests in BDD Cucumber syntax. And then, it will automatically translate the same into Cypress. What do you mean by hooks in Cypress? Cypress hooks are generally used to set or define preconditions that we wish to execute either before every test or before a set of tests. Some of the available hooks are after each, after, before each, before. Define the components of Cyprus. The major components of Cyprus are listed below. Test runner. It tests in an interactive runner, which further helps by letting you see the command and execute the same while viewing the application that is under the test. App preview. It helps in seeing the tests while executing the commands. Test status. It assists in displaying a summary of what tests are in progress and have failed or passed. Command log. It showcases the command logs while executing the tests. URL preview. It displays the URL of the test and assists in tracking the entire URL route. Viewport sizing. It helps in setting the app viewport size for testing varying layouts. How will you create a test suite in Cypress? We can develop a describe block as it acts as a suite. Inside this block, every test can be created by using a single it block. Is it possible to use XPath in Cypress? By default, Cypress doesn't support XPath. 
but with the help of the Cypress XPath plugin, we can use XPath to interact with all the DOM elements. We can install the plugin through npm. npm install Cypress XPath. How can you verify the title of a page in Cypress? A title of a page in Cypress can be easily verified through the should assertion as mentioned below statement. Define the types of assertions in Cypress. There are negative and positive assertions in Cypress. Positive assertions, negative assertions. How will you access Shadow DOM in Cypress? Shadow DOM generally helps in letting hidden DOM trees that has to be attached to the elements in a regular DOM tree. Shadow DOM can be comprehended through below mentioned command. How will you change the base URL dynamically? You can change the base URL dynamically through below mentioned key command. How will you press keyboard keys in Cypress? The keyboard keys can be pressed through below mentioned command. What a side dot contains command. Side dot contains command can be used to find the element by using their contents. Refer the below example for your reference. Hope these questions will enhance your knowledge. Thanks for watching our video. Subscribe us for more updates.